gratitude is one of the most powerful forces in the universe. Uh, that was a earlier class on gratitude. It is powerful because what you're grateful for, the universe brings to you. And when you express that, the universe brings more to you. So for a meditation, just like the affirmations, it's the same thing. When you go into a meditative space, you don't have to relax fully. You can if you want. It gives it more power if you can be more relaxed and focused. And you can do this anywhere. But you just breathe in three times deeply, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Say what you're grateful for. Say it three times. You know, I am grateful for X, Y, Z. You know, I am grateful for all of you watching this. In through the nose, out through the mouth. I am grateful for all of you watching this. In through the nose, out through the mouth. I am grateful for all of you watching this. In through the nose, out through the mouth. Say it three times to give it more power. And then keep going. What else are you grateful for? And just continue that that cycle of expressing gratitude for the universe to the universe for the things you're grateful for a lot of people tend to try to think of gratefulness as well it's the big things it's actually the little things focus on the little things the things that make you happy that bring you joy and laughter the things that make you smile the things that you might not have noticed throughout your day without paying attention and having awareness of oh yes this person made me smile i'm grateful for being uh, interacted with in such a way that made me smile or this person brought me joy in a small way or this flower was beautiful even though I only saw it for two seconds I'm grateful for that flower or there was a bird that flew across the sky and it was a bald eagle and I'm grateful that I got to see a bald eagle in flight different things like that it can be small things they don't have to be the big things of your day but they can be big things too and build your gratefulness continue telling the universe what you're grateful for and do that in meditation and again with sleep using sleep as a tool one of the things i do every night um most nights anyway i try to always remember is as i'm falling asleep and my eyes are closed and i'm starting to nod off i start going through the i am grateful statements i go spirit i am grateful for whatever it is sometimes it's the same things so everybody like i'm grateful for my cats i'm grateful for my friends uh, I might get super specific with things. There might be big things. There might be surprises. Uh, they, um, like I had a dragon fruit that I bought the other day and I'm like, I'm grateful for the dragon fruit. Saying those while I'm falling asleep because that is a meditative state and it can, is a tool that can help you um, if you use it as a tool. It's a tool if you use it as a tool to help you with different things like affirmations, gratefulness, meditations, dream work, all those sorts of things. So as I'm falling asleep, I'll do that to bring that energy into my reality too. And to also do it in water. Uh, I didn't touch on this in the affirmations, but this is a good place to touch on it here. When you're in a bath, when you're in the shower, saying I am statements, doing the affirmations, and saying the grateful statements, the things you're grateful for, because water carries energy as a portal. And it's just another way to um, create more energy around that if you're doing it in the portal of water, which is another topic in and of itself. But if you're not already expressing gratitude daily from the, towards the universe, try to set a time, whether it's first thing in the morning, uh, first thing when you go to fall asleep. I prefer when I go to fall asleep, because when I do that, it's the I can reflect on the day and say all the things I'm grateful for for that day. But that doesn't mean I don't do it throughout the day. Throughout the day, I say I'm grateful for this, I'm grateful for that, and I do that quite often. Uh, and that's important to do so that your guides can understand what you're grateful for, understand what you acknowledge, and bring you more of it. So if you haven't added that to your practice yet, start adding that because that is the most powerful force in the universe is gratitude, being grateful for what you do already have and what is already being taken care of, even the small things, the smallest things. If you have trouble finding something because you're in a bad living situation or, or something, there are still gonna be small things you can find that to be grateful for that will snowball energy towards building 
better things that you're grateful for. So start adding that into your practice. Uh, try, try to do that every day, multiple times a day if you can, speaking gratitude for things. Uh, and uh, you'll, you'll see that, that uh, energy snowball over time. Thank you for watching. Uh, I'm grateful for each and every one of you, and I love you all.